Hey, boss. I'm getting used to hearing that voicemail of yours. Dropped you a pin. Wanna come through? Hey, I'm glaring. What? Too busy to visit your fam? Nah. I was just giving you space after you got out. Don't need it. Besides, <laughs> we gotta settle some things. We do? See you soon, kid. Just go see him and get it over with, Mouse. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. Hey, do either one of you guys have a permit for those? Huh? Oh! Whoa! Mike! Mike! He's still breathing, but I'll get him to a hospital. I knew those fireworks looked shady. Is he gonna be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious, but I'm not taking any chance. Ah, where am I? Spider-Man? Don't worry, I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, but we didn't know. They're for our brother, Lex. We, we lost him a few years ago, and he always loved them, so we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh, man, I'm sorry. Spider-Man? Wow. At least I can still wiggle my toes. There. The staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, maybe you should check where we got them from. Some docks north of us between those two bridges. I think I know which place you mean. I'll take a look. Hey, just dropped Mike off. He thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. Watch it next to that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic.
Get me out! It's time to fight! Birthday, Lex. <laughs> Was that you? Oh man, I hope Mike saw that in the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. Disaster befalls our beautiful city. And guess who's to blame? In what should have been a routine prison transfer, the Spider-Men felt the need to inject themselves into a situation that was already being handled by the proper authorities and completely botched it. A new group of mercenaries made their presence known in the hijacking of the supervillain Scorpion and Mr. Negative. Not much of known about this new collective other than their pension for animal skin was that a good photo ah here we go now i'll admit stolen underground tech they try to rebuild themselves without Finn, but I'll put it to better use. Make sure Pete knows about this. There's an ambulance not too far away. I'll drop you right off. 
Just swing carefully, please. Hope that wasn't too rough of a trip. Take care. Thanks a ton. Man, people really don't appreciate you enough. <laughs> they really thought they had me. guys felt like they came out of a cult better tell Pete about them Chris is mine this time this crystal. Maybe I'm being paranoid, but everywhere I go, I see them too. Work, the corner store, in the park. They're tracking us. Marco was really freaked out. Wonder if whoever was following him is still out there. You really gotta do this with the mask on? Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look.
you. Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but... Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. You getting some? How did you... And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. Yeah, yeah. I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude could turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? Our school, college, anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some Prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Not bad, kid. the gate. Sweet. Can't pull it open from down here. Decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Hmm. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? Old suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. Listen. 
this isn't the only stash. Unk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. Don't want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay. I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con... Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again... Reminds me of the people who ride into the bugle. And a few who work there. Freedom of speech is a beautiful thing. But saying a thing over and over again doesn't make it true. Miles, club fair, remember? You on your way? Oh, right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon. players trash talking and the sound of rubber hitting asphalt there's a reason they call it the city game city seems pretty quiet still no sign of lee or the gang that took him <laughs> 